So just a quick uh, test, we're putting a new central heating system in here, hot water, cold water, and then obviously the central heating. So we're getting ready uh, for screening, but I thought I'd just do a quick review on testing a system. We're using the uh, Katsu here to, to test it. Um, in terms of uh, this item comes just bare, what I have done is had to make up just a testing rig here. So I've got a half to a 15 mil. I put a valve on here so I can turn the valve on and off. I have put a bleed screw on it as well. And then I'm just using a push fit to go from 15 to 22 to go on to the end of my return here. So, and then this is obviously my flow coming back in on the other side. I've capped that off so I can test the return and the flow. Um, I'm gonna test my system up to uh, about four bar today. So I'm just on four bar at the moment. And as I said, I can turn that valve off up there as well um, if you want to just hold the system and leave the system. So that's it really, fairly simple to use. Um, I've noticed that the pressure gauge on this does drop off slightly. So if you, if you close your valve off, come back and um, turn your valve back on, you might see your pressure gauge go back up, which means it must be, and I've tightened all these joins up, so obviously a little bit leaky from uh, there, which is why I put that valve on as well which I found uh, particularly helpful. The other good thing about this is, once you've built this, you can pick this up, take it over to your hot and cold, and test your hot and cold. So it's a nice, easy system to swap over. So anyway, pretty uh, quick little video on how to set these up and how to use them. Um, and so hopefully that's helpful. I think this has taken about three liters. So this system's taken probably six liters to test at the moment. So. There you go, um, hope that helps you just sort of how to get them set up and how to use them.